Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Mark Lansanga from Techno Buffalo, and today we'll be showing you guys our top five icon packs for Android. Now, if you're using a custom launcher like Nova Launcher, Apex, Action, or Aviate Launcher, you'll be able to apply these icon packs without a problem. If you haven't checked out our top five launchers for Android, we'll put a link down in the description, so make sure to check that out. This list is in no particular order whatsoever, so let's start off with number one, which is Rufus. Now this icon pack is free from the Google Play Store and offers more than 1300 icons that are shaped in a pretty unique octagon shape, complemented by pastel colors to give the icons a very unique look. The Rufus app offers six wallpapers to go with the icon pack and you'll also be able to request icons for apps that aren't fully themed. Rufus does offer Icon Mask, which essentially overlays a shape over the unthemed icons, making sure that the other icons that you have won't look too different. Now moving on to the second one, which is Eloon. Now this one you guys may have already seen in past videos, but this was my icon pack for over the period of two months when I was using the Galaxy Note 4. It's clean, simplistic, flat, and circular, which was something I was looking for at the time. Eloon is currently on sale for just 99 cents from the Google Play Store, whereas before you'd have to pay a dollar 99 cents. Eloon offers more than 3,000 icons that are constantly being updated every week, which is crazy to think about. Now icons look pretty sharp. The colors aren't as faded or flat as Rufus, though the colors in Elon really pop. You'll also get 31 wallpapers to go along with this icon pack and the ability to request icons that aren't themed, similar to Rufus. Next up is Naxos Taz. I hope I'm saying that right. Now this one is probably one of the first icon pack I ever bought in a Google Play Store, and I was looking for something flat, minimalistic, and something that didn't necessarily use a shape of some sort. The icons aren't Android Lollipop flat, meaning that the color palettes aren't the same, but it's using very contrasty colors, which is definitely something different from themes that we're used to seeing on the Google Play Store. Naxos Taz is $1.49 and if you want something different from the usual Android lollipop look, give this icon pack a try. The fourth one on our list is Stark Icon Pack. No, it's not an Iron Man theme, but it's an icon pack for minimalists. It has over 2100 unique icons rendered for QHD devices and offers a ton of cloud-based wallpapers within its app. This alongside Naxxus Taz were the very first ones I bought on the Google Play Store and actually transitioned between these two when I owned the HTC One M7. If you're a fan of hard edge square icons with a flat design, this is definitely something to check out. It is a bit on the pricier side coming at $1.99, but if price isn't an issue, then the Stark Icon Pack is definitely worth checking out. Now the fifth and last one on our list is called Julio, probably my new favorite icon pack just because it's so different from the rest. There aren't any colors, it's simple, it's white, and it's still very flat looking. It comes with over 2,000 icons that are also rendered for QHD devices and also offers cloud stored wallpapers just like the Stark Icon Pack. It also features icon masking for unthemed icons and an icon request tool within the app for any icons that you have that aren't themed properly. You can check out Juyo on the Google Play Store for $1.56. I know it's very weird pricing, but maybe that's why I like this icon pack so much. It's different from the usual flat material design icons, and speaking of which, I know that was our last one on our list, but I thought I'd also mention Moonshine as a wild card. If you're looking for an icon pack that resembles Lollipop, then Moonshine is pretty close to that. There are over 750 icons, 20 wallpapers, and everything is completely free. A new update which hasn't been released yet will apparently use the same color palettes as Android Lollipop, so once that update rolls out, Moonshine should look pretty much the same as Android Lollipop. Anyways, there you have it guys, let us know in the comments down below which ones are your favorite icon packs, we're definitely interested in hearing which ones you guys are using on a daily basis, which ones you want us to check out, and as always, I'm Mark Linsanger from Techno Buffalo. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and if you guys would like to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And we like to play video games every now and then in this office, so make sure to check us out at twitch.tv slash technobuffalo, and we hope to see you guys there.